Good morning, my name is Gemma and I am going to show you a little bit about what I do day to day. Um, I've got a couple of farms to do, it's about 5 o'clock in the morning at the moment. It is quite dark out so I'm not going to get much filming done in the dark. It's about two hours to the first farm so hopefully by the time I get there we can see a bit more and I can show you a bit more about what I do. Am I going straight round to the grain stores? Yeah, if you go there and then left up there, yep. and you go in front of that grain store there, and then if you back down, there's a little alley next to it, and then we'll load you over the fence. Ah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah I know what you mean. Alright, All right, perfect, thank you. Thank you. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
can load the back. Hopefully I'll get in the right place. So this is a grain passport. Every time you pick up grain, a farmer has to give you a grain passport because every load of grain that gets moved throughout the UK has to have a passport, just like cows do, basically. Um, what did I pick up last? Soya, barley, and wheat. So I have a um, onboard wire. So when I put my PTO switch in, put the PTO on down here and that will bring up the little light on the dash. It's just put a bucket in and I am on 200. So I reckon I've probably got about mm, 20 ton on maybe. I just lift the body up just to make sure. Do a little slight lift. Oh, 2160. Body down. Right. Now, hopefully, we'll make it. After being stuck behind a load of traffic, um, hopefully, we'll make it back to Clumpton within our time. Maybe a little bit touch and go, but we shall see. close to Wimborne um, and it is 20 past 8 so I know this road is going to be pretty busy because there's a school not far from here I'm going to have to be careful coming out of here because I'm loaded there's quite a sharp bend there on my right where if cars are whizzing round they are not going to know that I am pulling out fully loaded and I struggle because I'm heavy and it's wet. I had a little spin then. have arrived to tip. So put my high vis on, get my paperwork in and they will sample the wheat, 
and hopefully it will pass and then I can dip. Yeah. So the grain sample has been taken, it's passed, I've weighed in and now it's time to tip. Once I'm tipped, it's time to pack away and sweep out, ready for the next load. is down at Loddiswell near Kingsbridge um, so I'm going to ring the farmer let him know I'm coming um, and go and load some oats as far as I can, but I don't know if they'll be far enough. Hi, hey, 
not trying to get through Ladislau. Yeah, I know. I'm going to the farm just here. Nah, all okay, right. No, okay, just all make right. sure. Yeah, all right. All right, thank you. actually killed somebody coming down this road in the lorry. Right, now I think we need a bit of white plant spread to get up here. Do you want me to park? You swing around here. Yeah. And then back in the shed. Yeah. I'll show you when we're in there. All right. All yeah. Right. No worries. I said to the farmer that um, people didn't seem very happy with me going to the farm um, so he's going to check the village Facebook page later. is going north so let's go so I've just stopped in Michael Woods for half an hour break um, and after that I will get probably about an hour up the road um, to an industrial estate and that will be me for the night oh my CRS just turned up that's lovely Time for a shower. We're all fresh and clean, so let's get this last. 
last little leg done. Right, that's it for the day. So paperwork and tea. had my tea, gone for a little walk and I found out that tomorrow after tipping at Newport which is between Telford and Stafford I am heading up to Liverpool for a laid back down so that'd be a nice easy day hopefully depending on traffic <laughs>